Hey, family, this is the time of Sarah with TL. I came to give you a reading. I wanted to see what's going on with my fam, see how you're doing, and if there's any advice and or guidance or help or anything that could benefit you guys when you at the time of seeing this. Um, put them right there. Let's see. I'm going to get your energy. I want to know what's going on. Hold up. Give me a second. I gotta say a prayer. Okay, thank you. All right. I'm like, I usually do not do that on camera, but I was really like, whoa, pause in the play, pause in the play. All right, let's see what's going on. Um, I'm using um, J Coffee Personal Pizza Day. We have tightened up. It's time for some lifestyle changes, physical movement, self-love, rest and relaxation are needed now. What areas of life have you felt lacking or weakened? It's time to strengthen and tighten up. So that's where you're at right now. And look, you're changing your perspective. That's on the bottom. So you've been in, you're in a space of thinking and trying to like reflect and figure out like what's going on with yourself and where you're at in life right now. Okay. All right, let's see. Let's, let's get some more on this tighten up. And we'll get into some tarot. <sighs> Jay Coffee developed this, became a very beautiful passion project. Oh my gosh. We have Bubble. This person is walking away. They're suffering, feeling betrayed, and are protecting themselves. They may be battling with depression, sickness, trust issues, extreme life changing news. Mm, information so you're you're you know what it's time it's either you're walking away or and honestly i feel like you're walking away you got la rata at the end this energy isn't interested in giving right now yeah i think it's you honestly i think it's you deciding you don't want to um be involved with a situation anymore and i don't see anything wrong with that I don't see anything wrong with that. It's like is 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 one of swords. I said is I said one of swords, huh? Because that's literally what it says. But it's like the seven of swords. I'm at eight of swords, seven of wands, three of swords. It's a lot of mental. It's like a lot of mental anguish going on. Um, <clears throat> yeah. So you that's probably why you're in a perspective place of mind because you're like I gotta figure out who what's going on with my life and you had to make it there's some changes choices feeling blocked restrained my deck is oh my deck is upside okay great so yeah you got choices yo you how many times do we have to say the same thing it, everything is still saying the same thing it's you're in a place of choices you're in a transformative a tower hit you can't go back to yesterday. You can't take back anything that was said and or done. It, it, it happened. It is what it is at this point. Keep your temper. Maybe you did unleash the beast a little bit. Maybe you got tired of being quiet, of being passive or not even so. Yeah, well, passive. Allowing, you know, people to walk all over you. But let's get further. Let's see what's going on. In this situation, might have a dog. I just heard a dog barking. Could be dealing with a King of Pentacles. Saw the King of Okay. Yep, Four Swords. Okay, you're you're resting right now. But let, I need to know what happened in the past. What happened in the past with the person with whoever it needs to. Uh, I'm talking to right now. There was blocked communication. There was like blocked to no communication that was going on in in the past. Ace of Swords on the bottom. There was no communication, basically. Like, it was blocked. There was something going on. So what else was going on in the past? 
You got five of cups. Like, mm, damn. It's like you're... Uh, I feel like somebody was blocking you. Like, it's just like now you're just... Like, she's just pouring out those five of cups. Like, man, fuck it. Whatever. Oh, I apologize for cussing. But you know what I'm saying? Like, like whatever. Just had to... But it was like not only... Am I having, like, were you not communicating? It was no communication. And then on top of the no communication, there was no plans. Like, we're not going anywhere. We're stagnant. It's hangman on the bottom. We weren't going anywhere. So what else happened in the past with my collective and the person that, obviously, this happened with? Mm. They isolated. They went within. You went within. They, like, y'all basically... You know how you be in a relationship and seven of swords on the bottom. It was like they might have. You know what I really feel like? What happened? Yeah, they with none of that communication. You know what they did? Like they stonewalled you. There you go. There was a stonewall, but it was a part of their strategy. Look, two of swords. It didn't work. It, it was to bring confusion to you. Uh, yeah, fam. Like that. That was for you. Sheesh. So you probably popped. I'm like looking at that keep your temper card. And I'm like, yeah, you popped. You were like, how much more can I take? I'm sorry to hear that because it definitely felt like how much more can I take? Look, up three of cups. Yep, they had you in a third party situation. Yep, they had you in a third party situation, fam. Yep, left you out there. Cut the deck to five of pentacles. Left you feeling abandoned, alone, like you ain't have nobody. But that was, like, purposely done. They purposely did that. And then it was, like, and it was to hold you back and block you from moving forward in life. Look, six of, they wanted to take away your choice. They are trying to take away your choice. That's the six, that's the lover's card in reverse. There was no love. They wasn't giving you no love, but they was taking away your choice. Because the lover's card is about choice as well. And they was just, they took away your choice. They was probably spying on you, learned all these things about you to keep pulling you right back in. Mm, I'm sorry to hear that one. But let's see what's going on in our present. <laughs> yeah, I'm just like, wow. Okay, I, I can see why you would have your, you know what I mean, be feeling like you need to get a new perspective king of swords it is cut off the intelligence structure head over heart yeah you decided to make head over heart decision so what's going on in the present mm. yep queen of wands you decided you might see okay so you could be a, a leo sagittarius aries that i'm speaking to but you became the queen of wands in reverse basically you became a bitch for lack of better words, you was just like, oh, okay, you know the fuck, you know the f what? I got something for that. Demanding, vengeful, jealous, bully, low confidence. You definitely went a little bit. When they went low, you went to hell, basically. <laughs> uh, that's what happened. Yeah, you just, yep, you went, you went, yep, you went flip mode on them. You decided, you know what? I'm a balance. You, you became karma. Look, Knight of Swords, yeah, it was a big change, and they were not ready for it. You became, like, instant karma. Like, you became that to them, like, because you flip mode. Charming, artistic, mediator, caring, romantic offers. That's what they were trying to do to you. That was in the present. Let's see, what's presently going on? If this story is for you, hit that like, share, subscribe. If it's not for you, you know, let it fly. Five of Pentacles. You str struggled hardship. Now they feel out. Now they feel outcasted. Now they feel isolated. Now they feel blindsided. That's that. But okay, so in, in, for you now, you be you switch. Y'all basically you y'all flip roles and stuff. But I think that you decided that enough was enough. You was like, I'm not trying to manipulate you but i do think this was a strategy after a while like you know what like i okay like two can play this game after a while you know like i'm not trying to like i know everything i need to know about you but yeah i think it just yeah got a little messy it, was, it just got real messy like so what's what else and where are we heading where are we heading 
Nine of Wands, guarded challenges, persistence, fatigue, resilience, stamina. You know, after all this, I wouldn't be surprised that you're tired, honestly. I would not be surprised that you're tired. Page of Pentacles, ambitious, study, consistent. You decided, yeah, you're, like you said, like I said in the beginning, perspective. You you decided I'm going to sit down. I'm going to change my perspective. I need to uh, make a plan this time because, first of all, this person took you out of Eight of Swords. This person had you feeling trapped. They was messing with your head. They, they was taking you out of your character. They was taking you out of yourself. And in the present time, when you became that, you know, unfavorably person at the time, it was like, okay, I, it, it was probably due and in, 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 in a way just, but it wasn't. You went like, basically, you took it too far. Like I said, when, when they went low, you said, well, I can go to hell. I can go to hell. <laughs> Judgment, temperance, yes, yeah, awakening, renewal, reflection, purpose, balance. That's where we're heading. We're 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 heading for a renewal. You just have to keep being patient. The theme of patience, because that's why it says keep your temper. You have someone coming in. It's a new beginning that's happening. It's coming in fairly quick too. Um, yeah, it's the it's the chariot, the fool, three of pentacles. The divine is working in working on this one. You got the uh the major arcana starting to pop up now because it's like you know what my person my people my my people they learn they learned what they needed to learn the lessons had to be had and you know and now here we go it's time to bring that new new in someone who will work with them someone who will uh grow, wants to grow with them and be in alignment with them and not be la rata you know draining and. And psyching the sucking the life force out of your out of you. Let's see. Yep, look, declutter. You'll feel better and more focused if you'll take the time to clear away clutter from your living and workspace. Donate what you can to help others who that's people, places, and things. It's like, you know, in this time of reflection, in this time of healing, in this time of uh letting go, you can it's like that what they say, your environment reflects like what's going on, block out distractions. Your environment reflects what's going on inside or what you're really dealing with. Your life purpose and other priorities need your undivided attention. So it's time for you to take charge of your schedule and working environment by turning off electronics and avoiding anyone or anything that distracts you from what's important. You already know what these distractions are and you have the power to responsibly block them out. So you don't have to be petty or a bitch about it. Like I said, you went into the Queen of Wands uh, energy in reverse and decided, you know what? Like I said, two can play that game. You're being told like, hey, you can do this, but there's a way to do it without basically making you look like, you know, make you act in a way that you really don't want to act and have you out here looking crazy. Point blank period. On the bottom, attracting, not chasing positivity faith and optimism you open the doorway to positive experiences and opportunities with your positive expectations and energy do not allow negative energy or temporary setbacks to interfere with the path that you're on keep the faith and keep going all right let's see what else i want to give you a couple more messages so let's see just messages because this was you're doing what you, you're in a space or you're heading into the space that you need to head into but that situation was not good like they were really their goal was really to uh tear you tear your mental because they, that's just what they wanted to do they don't want you to be with anybody else and you gotta light your own fire now pele light your fire <sighs> let's see let's get you some advice card It's like I gave you the advice card when you cut that deck. That was Pele. It's like, oh, ooh, I can't take all that. Oh, I don't know. It might be a different deck. Star Maiden, rest. We have the Star Maiden card, rest. And Agma, watch your words. Yep. Look, how much... Let me read this. Uh, get the book. We're going to read Star... Why, no, we're going to read... 
watch your words because let me tell you infuse your language with light your words matter hm. oh my is the Celtic warrior, god of literature, eloquence, and speech. He's the champion of the Tuatha Dandanan, the ancient Irish pantheon of divine beings, a lord of knowledge. He created the Oam script, the earliest system of writing in Ireland. Oma is said to have conceived many languages and poetry that were imbued with rays of light. Celtic mythology describes sunshine beaming from his hair, and he's given the epic sun face and strong man. Oma teaches us about the tremendous power of words and supports writers, linguists, and orators. So you could be all those things and you could probably, you know how it says there's a better way to uh, block out this distraction. You probably could message and write it and, and, or, and email it or whatever the case is and still get your point across. Never have to speak to that person, but still say everything you need to say and keep it pushing. You know what I'm saying? Um, I really like this reading. Wasn't too sure about it at first because I'm like, I was just curious. Like, what is, like, why? Because they are energy. Whoever, if it's you, then I just think that you, if it's you, I hope not it, it being, so you're here looking to see what's going on. Make good choices. So I hope it's not you because that definitely just fell out in my lap. Um, You on the other end, I hope this is just like, not hope, but. If this is being done to you, you know, you're moving in the right direction. But if you're doing this to somebody because energy is interchangeable, um, you need to let this go and let them rest and be selfless and stop trying to keep their choice away. Perspective is everything. So much about perspective being spoken about as you got to you have to change your perspective. It's OK to let like maybe you thought that this was someone that was your lover, that was your soulmate, that somebody that you was going to be like forever with. And it's not 1717 when I when I said that that could be why perspective is really being highlighted highlighted look at what they do not what they say it's like they have they been treating you to be feeling like that they're your twin flame your lover and all these i don't really want to say twin flame because twin flame they got to go through that karmic stage so you could be still on the path but you're dealing with the karmic version that's not the version that we're supposed to be you know that that's going to that, that's not going to be the end of the union it's going to keep the cycle going to keep going so y'all both get it right no one is coming to save you. So you're going to have to get yourself, learn your lessons. You're going to have to get yourself up out of this situation. And like I said, perspective, that's why that page of Pentacles came out talking about, you know, going back to the drawing board, relearning, having to take your time, slow down with this planning and not trying to rush into some, something. You have to make yourself better at this time and you need to forgive yourself as well. All right, fam, like that's y'all reading. Y'all be safe. Hope it uh, helped in some way, shape, or form. If not, there's so many other readings that I have. But if and if not, you know my sis Jay Coffee because we the best of both oracles. My sis Jay Coffee, you can check her out in the Oracle House and see if some of her readings might be a little bit more in alignment with where you need to be in life or where you're trying to head in life. So y'all be safe. Like I said, read the description box. Hit that like, share, subscribe. Peace.